we try to propagate agnonema and sometimes it ends up by rotting. So today I will be sharing an authentic and successful way of propagating aglonema. So check this out. So this is the aglonema valentine, which has pushed out a new shoot from the base. And here has a long healthy stem. If you look carefully, you will see the plant has some aerial roots which are not actively growing. Now I can cut it from here and can propagate as cutting, but if I do so, I will face some issues. First, the plant will utilize lots of energy to form roots after inserting into the soil. And as a result, the plant will lose its lower leaves or show discoloration of the leaves, which ultimately will deshape the plant. Furthermore, the plant will wilt if humidity is not maintained, sometimes failed to stem rot. So to avoid all these issues, I'm not going to divide the plant. Instead of that, I'm going to follow the air layering propagation technique. Air layering is a form of propagation in which the branch is attached to the parent plant and is wrapped in a moist growing media. And as the stem grows roots, it is separated from the parent plant and grown as a separate plant. So, to air layer an aglonema, you need a transparent thin plastic cup that will allow seeing the root development, need scissors, packing tape, and growing media. Here I have used Miracle Grow Succulent Mix. You will get the product links in the description box and pinned comment. Cut a side of the plastic cup. make a hole at the bottom as I'm doing. Now install the cup, wrap it around the stem and now it is all the way into the cup. Then seal the cut side using packing tape and then Fill the cup with growing media. Make sure the stem is placed at the center. And finally, spray water. After all of this work, here are some simple maintenance. Number one, you need to keep the soil moist. I will water when 50% of the soil is dry. The soil should not be overwatered or underwatered. Also keep the pan plant hydrated I will keep this plant where it was before, but will make sure this layered portion is not moved or disturbed. This stem will take around 15 to 17 days to root properly, but I will separate the stem when the stem will be nearly root bound and this transparent cup will allow me to observe the root growth. I will provide an updated video, so if you are interested to learn more, then feel free to subscribe with the bell. Also, if you want to know the potting mix for aglonema plant, then check the video that is displayed on the screen. Thank you so much for watching this video and we will see you in the next one. Take care.